I have a message from the Lord. Now, now let me tell you what happened with this song. See, I, I, I have a friend by the name of Ronald Winans. Anybody ever hear the Winans before? CCBB. Well, there was a, the older brother Ronald, he, um, he had a heart condition. And by the time we got him to the doctor, 80% of his heart was not functioning. 80%. Excuse me, I'll try to keep this in English. And when we got there, the doctor told us that he would not walk out of that hospital, that it was impossible for him to live. They said there was no hope at all. And we cleared the hospital of everybody, no visitors that did not believe that the healing was going to happen. The doctor promised us that he wouldn't live and we asked, we told the doctor if he's going, to, well, he's going to live. And when he does live, you've got to come to church. Well, two weeks later, he went into the surgery and had a 14-hour surgery. And when they, when they did the surgery, the surgery was a success. And as they were closing his heart up, they had taken it out of his chest and doing it on this little apparatus. And, and when they put it back in and hooked it all up to the veins and the arteries and started the blood to go, the heart exploded. They took the heart back out, put it on the apparatus, came out. No oxygen. The anesthesiologist was out there crying because he was a friend of ours. No oxygen, no heart in his body, no blood going through his system for over 10 minutes. And they're telling us he's gone, he's dead. Pop Wyden said he's not dead. He said, go back in and do it again because he's not dead because God said no death. you got to believe what God said. If he said you're healed, you're healed. No, ma no, no matter the condition, no matter what pain you have, no matter how withered the hand, no matter how long it's been, if he said you're healed. Let me... Uh, and... Uh, and he died, they said. Ten minutes they're telling us, and after Pop told him he wasn't dead, he said, do you mind if we pray for you? Three wonderful Jewish doctors. Do you mind if we pray for you? They said, no, and you know, us Holy Ghost Pentecostal people, we travel with oil in our pockets. Pulled out the oil, greased our hands, and over a hundred people in the chapel laid hands on three doctors. Sent them back up 45 minutes, they came running down saying, Come upstairs right now, nothing but good news. What had happened while they were back in there trying to put him back together so that they could send him back down to the morgue, one doctor, Dr. Deeds, took his fingers and pressed down on the heart just, up. I don't know why he did it, pressed down after they, they had set everything back in, they were only doing it to send him to the morgue, pressed on the heart, and the heart started beating. I feel the Holy Ghost. That was on a Saturday. The next day was... Sunday and we were in church praising him and, 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 and Pastor Winans asked me to come up and to sing and I sang this song My, I, I feel the Holy Spirit I'm sorry somebody's in for a miracle that you've been waiting for for a long time uh, uh, and the song just said this I have a message from the Lord hallelujah A message, oh my friend, for you. It's recorded in his word. Hallelujah. Jesus said it, Masha, and I know it's true. What did he say? Look at me, my brother, live. Look to Jesus now. It's recorded in his word, hallelujah. And it's only that you look and live. Look at me, my brother, live. Look to 
I just did, but it's a Pentecostal thing. Ha! 